one, I want to thank everyone for coming today, particularly the guys behind us who are out there saving lives every single day of the week and are the real heroes of this island. Um, we're standing in a beautiful place. I mean, look at the backdrop, you're filming the mountains. And it's an area that we want to do better with. And we really want to thank both HCDA and Ward Villages for stepping up when we approached them about finding a location to have a, a dock and a boat to go out and save lives on this side of the island, the South Shore. As you know, we have major swells coming in today. That's good for the surfers. But you also have people that are inexperienced that go in the water too. And it's all about how do we work together to do better. So HCDA, Howard Hughes stepped up, committed to help us buy a Boston Whaler, a 21-footer, I think, 21-footer, um, for about $120,000. That's a lot of money for the city to find. And they stepped up and said, we'll provide the money to buy this Boston Whaler. And then they said, we'll give you another 21000 to put in a dock and a lift for a jet ski that's going to be right kind of behind us, right here in Kiwalo Basin, um, with a ramp so you can take people who are on the boat up to one of our great ambulances here where our paramedics and, and, and EMTs can take care of people and save lives. And here's the best thing about it. It's minutes from here to Waikiki. It's minutes from here to Diamond Head. It's minutes from here to the airport and other surf places along here. It's minutes from here to Kei Lagoon. And so we can save lives by approaching those who are in trouble in the water from the ocean as well as the land because the lifeguards who are standing here are in the towers along these beaches and they can paddle out, they can swim out, they can jet ski out, um, but they can also then use this boat to come in from the sea, do rescues, put multiple people on one boat with a firm platform where they can perform CPR in the water basically, AED to help people who are having heart attacks, um, body splints, all the things that they would do in an ambulance they can do on this boat closer to where the trouble is, saving lives, getting them to shore quicker here at Kiwala Basin, and then it's a short drive either to Queens or Straub or Kapiolani. This is a good thing. This is about a city working together. It is about working together here in the heart of Honolulu in Kaka'ako, a great place with great bone structure that's going to become even more a place of life and saving lives. And so again, I want to thank HDA. I want to thank Ward Villages for helping us do this. And I'm really, really anxious to have a start. Um, if it's okay, I thought maybe we'd ask um, one of the lifeguards who'd like to talk, maybe. Where's Mr. Where? You're right, come on. Look, come up here and say a few words if you yeah. like. Sure. He has his sunscreen on, I don't, but. Uh, <laughs> uh, thank you, Mr. Yeah. Mayor. Um, this is just, in, in, in our operational sense, the best possible location that we can work from to best provide for the health and safety of all the millions of people who are using our South Shore waters for all the many activities that they use. Everything from surfing, body surfing at Point Panic, the people that are out in the six-man canoes every night, everybody who is diving, fishing, people that are out on jet skis, people that are out on one-man canoes, the whole gamut of activity we're now going to be able to get to quicker and get to them with the equipment that we can get them on board and we can actually treat them at a much higher medical level rather than having to bring them to shore and then begin medical treatment. We know this is going to save lives. You know, we're, we're happy today that this is an opportunity to really show how we're gonna make this one of the best communities to live in in the world. Um, the best communities have the best amenities and our amenity is the ocean. We have a tremendous park space and oceans just out front, great surf coming. And what better way to take advantage of that amenity than to make it safer? And so through this donation, we're able to provide additional safety for those that recreate in our open spaces. And again, making this one of the best places to live in in the world. So thank you. Thanks, Race. I just want to mention one thing that is important for all of us to think about. Um, when you call 911, uh, a lot of these emergencies are time sensitive. Especially in the ocean when somebody is in the water and they need help, it's important to get to them quickly. We were able to do that with the jet skis in the past and put them on the sled and take them to shore, but now we have, like the mayor said, a boat to put them into, into and treat them on the boat. So this is a huge step forward uh, for us to provide uh, public safety to the citizens and the visitors here in Honolulu. Thanks. Tony, anything else? Any other lifeguards want to say anything? You want to say anything? We're good, Leo. thank you very much. This guy's in charge of training from Makaha.
No? You okay? We're good, good, we're good. Okay, good. All right. Tony, anything? So, Tony? anyway, uh, so they'll be located here and operating out of Kiwala Basin Harbor, working together with our, our lessee, Victoria Ward, Howard Hughes, in the harbor. Um, we're uh, working again in concert to secure that vessel uh, so that we can bring that service and, and then allow them to do their job. And so all the credit goes to uh, Ocean Safety Division and their people for doing their job, and we're just helping. Again, HDA, thanks for being a great partner with the City and County of Honolulu and our villages. And thanks so much for helping us. And Kaka, a lot of good stuff happening. Thanks.